love is hard enough as it is, but here in Arkansas Fed, things get even more complicated. Especially seeing two star-crossed lovers, Romeo and Juliet. Now, one lived in Nut, one in Baswell. Apparently, they're not allowed to be together due to a bitter rivalry held since they first built Baswell two years ago. Hi, my name is William S. Spear, and today I will go and look deeper and find out what may have caused the rivalry to begin with, and maybe find out what happened between Romeo and Juliet, who have been missing for over a week. See, uh, Nut and Baswell, yeah. Um, two years ago they built Baswell, and, uh, this guy, I guess some feuding kind of got going because people thought Nut was the greatest place, which, in my opinion, of course, I think Brown is the best, but when Baswell came along, people from Baswell started saying, oh, we're new, we're better than Nut, Nut's kind of, you know, the older, more traditional, we're better, we've been around longer, and that type of thing, and it's led to a lot of feuding, you know, people actually got in fights in the streets, in the cafeteria, over their halls, and uh, Battle of the Halls just got ridiculous, actually, actually one uh, child was injured in Battle of the Halls, so I think it's a little bit ridiculous from my point of view, just where they live, but that's kind of how it is. So there's two families, Montagues and Catholics, one Romeo, the other Juliet. Forbidden love can never happen, the families won't allow it at all. Shakespeare's play, the whole time they're running around trying to be together, trying to find some way to, have to be together. But ultimately, the only way they, they can be together is in death. And that's how it happens. You know, no happy ending. I don't care what all these chick flicks are doing these days, trying to copy it and make it all sappy and everything, but Shakespeare did right. It what? Arkansas Tech? There's not a Romeo and Juliet at Tech. There is Bagwell and Nut? Uh, I don't, I don't know what I'm talking about. Wait, you you brought me in here to talk about Romeo and Juliet, two people that I don't know on Tech Campus, like in their personal lives and stuff, which I don't care about. And you don't wait. What? You don't know where they are? Well, uh, Romeo and Juliet. If anything, if they're missing, they're probably you know dead tragically somewhere. You know, kill each other because they can't be together. I hope, uh, good luck with that, guys. Uh, I don't really care, and you're wasting my time. I'm just gonna take my stuff to eat. Here we have Nut. One of the richest dorms in Arkansas Tech. Home of Juliet. I didn't manage to gather a lot of information on Juliet, but from what I know, she was born in Flippin, Arkansas, and she was an English major, and was a freshman. Um, I'm not sure, but I believe if you look closely, her room used to be that one right there. This used to be her room in my research. Now, I'm unable to get inside the dorms due to, you know, security. So, basically as far as I can get. But, I was managed to interview people. So, yeah. Well, Juliet is my roommate. She moved in, and I thought she was just this weird little girl from Flippin, Arkansas, but she turned out to be pretty cool. You know, I like her. She's a secondary education English major, and she's pretty nice. And we went to a party one night, and she saw this really cute guy. I, mean, I agree. He was pretty cute. But then we found out it was Romeo from Baswell. I don't like him. Baswell guys are just not good at all. I'm like, Juliet, don't do it, don't do it. He's from Baswell. Does she listen to me? No. So, she goes ahead and goes out with him. And then one night I woke up and she was gone. Just snuck out the window. The window was wide open and everything. Haven't seen her since. Me and Juliet, we broke up a couple of weeks ago. She hooked up with some guy named Romeo at this party, a frat party. I guess he's in a fraternity or whatever. But I'm in one too, so it's just... I'm so much better than him, and I'm from Nut, and he's from Baswell of all places. I mean, 
No, guys, there's so much better than basketball people. And he's so scrawny. I mean, look at me. I have big muscles. I work out all the time. I take protein shakes, take steroids. I just have a better build than he does. I don't see what she sees in him. Because I'm just so much better than he is. And I'm so much better. Like, I'm model material. That's what I am. But him, like... No girl would do a double take on him. He's just that ugly. So I don't see what she sees in him. But for right now, I don't care what she sees. She can do whatever she wants with him. Where, wherever. She can go wherever she wants. She might as well go to space. And I don't care where she is. And I don't care where he is. If I see him, I'm just going to punch him in the face. Because I just know I look better. I'm a better person than him. And he's just lower than me. 